What's going on today, guys? Well, I think it's tip number tip number one, basically, when you're starting out a business, you gotta ask yourself, do you want payments or do you want to fix shit? I think it was a year ago, maybe a year and a half ago, we bought this uh, bought this sawmill because, of course, we're in a tree business, so I have all this wood everywhere. What do I do with it all? So it's either you throw it all away, you try and give it away, or you turn it into something that's more usable. So this is a 2017 uh, HM130 Woodlands Mill. Great machine. I picked it up for like 5,500 bucks. Uh, that was in 2019, and it was basically, I think it's 7,500 bucks brand new. So I got two, two grand off by buying it used. If you're looking to buy it in one of these things, it's really, it's a, from what I've seen, it's really great. Um, had one issue with, uh, with a coil and a spark plug going bad, but of course that's just your usual consumables that you're gonna have to replace eventually anyway. It came with a valve that made it so every time you turn on the, on the throttle, it automatically lubed the blade and everything. So that's all super, super nice and easy. I kind of deleted that just because the old rings have been, been kind of worn out after sitting for a while or whatever. But we got a client that is looking for a bundle of six footers to put in his garden. So we're going to give him 25 and turn this uh, basically $2 firewood into about a $50, $50 grade steak log. Yeah, enjoy the show after I, after I get this fixed. Full wonder, gotta love it. Basically, well, kind of what we got going on on a on a iffy day. A lot of times, we'll try and do this when it's going to be rainy or not good conditions to like take a skid steer over somebody's lawn, or if it's pretty wet and the ropes are going to slide a little bit too uh, not too well. So that's when we save the sawmill and stuff like that. But of course, this business is growing because lumber prices and things are crazy. But uh, I think probably at the, by the end of things, we get paid for a log almost five times. By the time we when we cut it down to when it's going out lumber or chips or slabs or whatever I've got paid for that log five times which is really nice um, which isn't something you can do with most businesses so if uh, if you get the means if you get the, the supply of course we have a lot going on here and every day we're every day we're adding to the pile so every day I'm trying to get rid of the pile as well so uh, yeah if you've got any questions guys feel free to leave them below like subscribe uh, we're going to try and do a lot more of these videos now just because we got some some things are kind of in line and we got some time to do that kind of stuff. So uh, uh, happy sawing guys, happy cutting, be safe out there and uh, as always if you want to see something feel free to shout, tell us what you're looking for and uh, we'll see how we can help you out. Casey Elmer over and out with Top Branch Tree Service. We're going to uh, finish these grade stakes up and uh, see if we can make somebody's garden that much better this year.